Marcy. So for today's total body workout, I'm outside. I hope you can get outside somewhere wherever you are or if you're an inside worker out, which I usually am too, except when there's mosquitoes, I refuse to work out outside. I want you to really get into this workout. There's a couple new exercises and this is a workout for today. All right, so all you're gonna need for today's workout, I have a mat behind me. Um, if you don't have a mat, if you're inside, you're cool, you can use your carpet, you can use the gym floor, whatever you wanna use, and you're gonna need uh, some type of step. So I have a step that I'm gonna use here. If you're at home, get near your stairs at home, and I believe that's all you need, so let's get into today's workout. So those of you that find planks to be absolutely boring, you're getting tired of them, you want a variation, this is going to be your variation and it's going to be a tougher variation. As you just saw in the description, we're going to be doing one-armed uh, planks. So what you're going to do, a regular plank, you're getting up into the plank position. Feet shoulder width apart, hand shoulder width apart. You're engaging your core. So engaging your core, like I like to always give an example, act like someone's scaring you and you're tensing up your core. Remember your core is your abs and your lower back. So instead of being in a traditional plank, we're going to slide one hand to the middle of our body and this hand is going behind our back and we're holding this plank for the interval, okay? Now if you get tired, the variation, if you don't want to put your hand behind your back, you can put it on your, uh, close to your elbow like this. So hand down and then you're holding, okay? So keeping your body extremely tight. You're probably gonna have to go down and rest your knees. I know I will. Okay, so just rest for a couple seconds, roll those wrists out, get right back up into that plank. And remember to breathe, okay? So planks, very effective exercise. You need to work on holding your planks longer and longer each time. The, the longer you do that, the stronger your core is gonna be. Remember that you're also gonna be doing your right and your left hand based on the workout description. All right, so for the cardio part of this workout, we got the abs going with the one arm planks, the cardio for this workout. We're gonna be using our step, and I'm not quite sure of a name. I'm gonna come up with a name before I post the video. But what you're gonna be doing, you're gonna be stepping one foot up and raising your hands. So you have one foot up, you're going to alternate down, up. Okay, so by putting those hands up, you're working out your shoulders. Remember, anything above your head, you're working out your shoulders, which we want, and also our back alternating the feet we're going to be working on those calf muscles a little bit and we're also going to be you know total legs and cardio so real time like this so as you can see it's really light feet you're not landing extremely hard light feet up and down for the interval set and that's going to be that exercise all right, hang tighter, so that was a workout for today. I hope you enjoyed it. The one arm planks are extremely difficult, so make sure that you use proper form. Watch the video over again if you need to see proper form. Beginners, try hard. If you have to go down on your knees, that's completely fine, and I'll see you guys for our next workout. Bye.